the idea of doing a social media project around climate change just seemed like a great experiment to offer. You know, how do you take a systems problem and reduce it to a single icon? This was part of the challenge, I think, as designers. Could we make a convincing argument for why we need better optics around climate change? and why something like SMS emoji would be a really quick kind of shortcut to these issues. I developed this project with a woman who graduated last year named Vinyata Pani. She and I kind of co-conceived the project and then we workshopped and developed with a variety of students both at ITP and through the Environmental Studies Department. What were concepts of climate change that could be reduced to something as simple as a single emoji? I tend to use humor as a kind of weapon. And I think humor is very disarming and permits a lot of different people into a conversation. This one, I think, has a lot of metaphoric potential <laughs> for use in your life. How is it possible that this thing that we think is somewhere in our nebulous future, climate change, is going to become a disaster, which isn't true, it's already here. When does this become useful to us to describe other kinds of conditions? I feel like, if you can keep this front of mind in that way, that you understand the connection between the personal and the political, or the personal and the climatological, your environment and yourself, and those can become expressive tools for you, the more that these issues are actually part of your life.